Hello, hello and welcome to another tutorial. Today I'm going to teach you how to use the free effects which come with a green screen background which you can find on the channel. You should be able to preview everything on the channel and search for the one that suits better what you need and then all you have to do is download the effect using a YouTube downloader which you can Google for any website which does that or you can have a extension on your browser and then once you have the video all you have to do is open Premiere create a project in this case I'm just using a background picture here from Harry Potter and we are going to try and add a fireplace over this area here so what we're going to do is click and drag the footage into Adobe Premiere on the timeline on top of our background image or video whatever you're using and then once we have it on premiere we're gonna see that well it has this green background so what we have to do is search on the effects panel for key you have many different options of a key effect which is basically for removing a specific area of the image the one you are going to use the most is called ultra key so we're gonna click and drag this to the footage of the effect and then what we can see here is that on our uh, effects control with the footage selected we have a ultra key here added and it has this thing here called key color and you just need to click on the symbol to select a color on your video in this case we're gonna click on the green and there we go it's gone just like that so all you have to do really is drop this effect and select the green color on your footage now I'm gonna give some tips of how to blend this with what you have on the background uh, for example here we want to click on position and be able to move this around so if you have nothing selected for example you don't have your clip selected you can't move things you need to click on the video that you want to move and then you need to click on the motion panel here and now we can like position it here maybe scale it down a bit you can also use the sliders for this you can click and drag this value here and it will change the scale like this so you're gonna leave it like this and we want I think for the perspective we want to mirror this image so we can go here into the effects panel and we can search for a horizontal horizontal flip and then when we drop this the fireplace will be facing the other side um, we're gonna position it a bit better so we want to make this fit the lightning of the scene so we can come here into the effects and we can just type um, curves and we're gonna have this RGB curves here we're just gonna click and drag and apply this to the video and what this does uh, it opens these graphics here you have a master one which is basically the light we have a red a green and a blue and this works like this the top area of the graphic is the bright areas of the footage and the the bottom here is the dark areas so everything you click and move is going to affect uh, depending on what you're trying to do so in this case here what we want to do is basically we want to make the whole thing darker so we can click right in the middle of the master here line it's going to create a little point and this as you can see if I move up it makes everything brighter if I put it down it makes darker so we can make this very dark and then the blacks are a little bit too much we can create another one here in the bottom and maybe soften this by raising up a bit and then let's say the image was uh, a lot more blue we could actually go into the red one click and drag down to remove the reds from our footage and we could click and drag on the blue one up to add more blue and you can see how these can change the colors to just actually fit the footage that you have and the green one for example will make it more green or if you remove you're gonna get purple so once you click and drag up you're gonna be adding the color from the graphic in this case red 
and if you move down on the opposite direction you're gonna get the opposite color which is blue on this case we just need to adjust the brightness you can play around with this a lot and just to fit the right color and there we go it already looks very good and as always you just need to remove the intro so you go to the part in the timeline where the video starts you press C on the keyboard to change to a cutting tool and you cut it right there and you click on V to go back to the selecting tool you select the start of this which is the intro and you press delete and then you have the rest which is just the effect and you can move it around on the timeline it's pretty straightforward and I hope this gave you an idea on how to use the green screen background effects to animate scenes or to add things on your footage and yes I hope this was very useful to you and don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed the tutorial and if you are enjoying all the free effects and I'll see you next time